What's up everybody, welcome back and in our previous video we have already seen that how we can use the basic permutation feature of the mid journey which created amazing 40 different images with a single prompt that we have already covered in previous video. In this video we are going to combine the aspect ratio parameter of the mid journey with the permutation parameter to create amazing permutations and combination of a single artwork but in different aspect ratio without rerunning the command again and again but now with permutation you can create artworks in multiple aspect ratio simultaneously so let's see a quick example of it all right so here we are on our discord and we are going to write imagine and we are going to paste our prompt here we have our prompt which is an abstract of woman painting featured and these are different styles that i have specified in the style of optical body illusion art art of the congo I can't believe how beautiful this is. These are complete prompt. And the main thing that you need to notice here is these little things. Here what we have done is we have specified the AR parameter by writing dash dash AR. And after that we have started our curly braces as you know with the permutation. This is the syntax. In the braces we have written different multiple aspect ratios. First is 4 is to 5. Then 16 is to 9. Then 2 is to 3. And 4 is to 3. Similarly, if you want, you can add more and it is going to produce our same prompt and convert it into different aspect ratios. So one more that we want here is let's say we want 5 is to 2. Okay, then hit the enter key and here it is asking that are you sure you want to execute this template? Here, 5 jobs are going to start based on this template that we have given because our subject is same or our main item is one and we have specified five different aspect ratios for it. That's why it is going to create five different results. Okay, so I am fast forwarding this video until we got all of our results processed. All right, so now our results are ready. And if we see, this is the first result that we got where we have this amazing looking portrait of a woman and here we have the aspect ratio as a specified 4 is to 5. Similarly, if we take a look at our second result, here we got the same prompt but this time it created 16 is to 9 aspect ratio for us. And what I can say is the image 2 and 4 are really awesome. And others are also awesome but there is a frame kind of thing in the image 1. Rest, all of them are really fine. Similarly, here we got the aspect ratio 2 is to 3. For your social media, you can easily share these things. And these are some amazing results. Next, we have the images or the same prompt in the ratio of 4 is to 3. And it also got some cool results, especially the first one and the second one. And at last, we have our aspect ratio 5 is to 2. And as we all know that mid-journey version 5 allows you to go off limit with the aspect ratio. You can literally write any aspect ratio and it is going to create the artworks for you, irrespective of the version 4, which only allows you to create artworks in a defined set of aspect ratio. But with 5, you can really type anything or any aspect ratio that you want your images in and it is going to put or throw out the results for you. Here, these are some amazing artworks with the 5 is to 4 aspect ratio. So this is a very simple example of combining the aspect ratio parameter and the permutation parameter of mid journey. Next up, let's see that how we can combine the seed parameter along with the permutation parameter. So what we are going to do is we are going to write a prompt here and here is our prompt. So we will write imagine, then we will paste our prompt, which is beautiful ancient dress concept art portrait, stunning photorealistic and all of these style but at last what we have given is we have given the seed parameter with different seed value so in these curly braces we have specified multiple seed values for the same prompt and here we again got five different seed parameters so again it is asking are you really sure you want to create five different jobs with the same prompt and we have click on yes button and as you see our five different seed parameters are now turned into each separate job in the mid journey and it started creating the results for us all right so here we got our results this is the first result with the seed parameter 89082 where we have amazing portrait of a woman with red hair and as per our desired prompt these are the results with the seed parameter first similarly this is the second seed parameter and with it we can get similar kind of result but there is a quite little difference between first seed and the second seed then if we go below here we can see again our character is looking very similar but there is only minor changes to their styles. So in this way it is also a really great feature with which you can create consistent characters 
here if you want you can just use all of these images and because they are displaying a specific kind of character in all of them with very little variation here we already got our consistent characters so you can clearly see the face the hairstyle the background and multiple things are just similar in all of these different images similarly here we have the fourth result where still the characters are same but there is a very little or minor variations in them and here we have the fifth prompt results with the seed parameter of 1029 so if you want to create some really similar looking images then you can just give your prompt and in the curly braces you can use the permutation and specify multiple seed values for the same prompt so that you can get some of the really similar looking images of your artworks all right so these are two use cases now in this video we are also going to cover third and last use case which is if you want you can also introduce stylize and the chaos parameter and combine it with the permutation to get some really amazing artworks so let's quickly see that how we can do it here we'll write imagine this is our prompt a young girl in a traditional outfit in the style of jessica drossen intensive portraiture exotic national geography photo detailed texture highly ornamented and at the end of our prompt we have opened the curly braces and inside it we have specified different values of the chaos and stylized parameters for first one we have write chaos value of 14 and the stylization of the 300 then we have written the chaos value of 50 and the s parameter 2000 similarly we have written c100 and the stylization to the 500 then hit the enter key and see what are the results that it is going to produce for us based on our permutations we already know that only three images is what it is going to produce but our result will contain different artistic styles because of the chaos parameter along with we have also mentioned the stylized keyword in it so we have combined the stylized and the chaos parameter along with the permutations to get some really different kind of artworks with a wide variety of range okay so here we can see our prompt results are completed and these are the results and this is the first result with the c parameter or the chaos parameter of 100 and the seed value of 500 we can see in all of these four images there are different styles and in the first image we have this cute girl with a specific kind of theme on the other hand we have another kind of girl where the character and the facial features are entirely changed the position is different composition is different coloring theme is different and everything is different so we can clearly see that chaos and the stylized is working really well if we take a look at our next image here we have the ruler kind of girl with amazing muddy kind of background then we have amazing second girl little cute girl with another kind of background and styles then we have a british uh, little cute kid with other things and similarly the fourth image also have different kind of styles compositions and varied results this time we have given the chaos 50 and stylized it to the thousand similarly in the third result we have specified the chaos to 14 and the stylized to 300 and these are the results on front of you so in general you can say that the permutation feature of the mid journey allows you to create some of the really coolest artwork ever with single prompt it means that now you can create a large number of different images that are similar looking or that are totally different by combining other parameters with the permutation parameter so it is a really cool feature to have in the mid journey and it takes the games of your content creation or the art generation to the next level all right so that's all for this video and if you have any sort of doubt and question then please ask them in the comment section so that's all for this video thank you for watching and goodbye